Hi friends, hope you're doing well. I'm Dr. Malin Chinde, MD Pediatric from M. Supar. So I welcome you all in another episode of Train PG Tech Easy. So today I'm going to talk about one very interesting observation that I made during my preparation time. So we are all very anxious and very uncertain about our selection. Hamasha, hamare dil mein idhar rehte hai ki hum select honge ya nahi. And there is always this uh, new word they say FOMO, that feeling of missing out. Ki baaki ke log kya padh rahe hai, what they are reading, and am I missing out on something? So uh, when I was preparing, there are a lot of mistakes that I made during my preparation time, and then I worked on them, and then I improved them. So I'm going to share when uh, very interesting observation that I uh, made during this preparation. So whenever uh, whenever you go through uh, this uh, preparation phase, you will see there are a lot of uh, interesting aspects. So I will uh, just tell you that there are three kind of students that you will get. Like whenever you are preparing, you will get three kind of students in. Uh, your preparation time so who are these uh, three kind of uh, students so just a, a fact i'm sharing with you so there is first group who are these talented and uh, you know these gold medal students so these students are like they are studying since their first year they are like foundation batch student they know everything they have studied everything and uh, you know they are like always very serious about pg prep that uh, they did not i mean they had a the fun in their life but they were very regular about their studies so they had clear the set of mind that they finished their portion on time and now they are giving a lot of gts and they are scoring good in gts very consistent so these are talented and gold medalist student second group of students are students who are kind of relaxed i mean if you meet them now they will tell you they have very modest expectations from life they are like i want to get uh, i mean i am not uh, i mean i am just ranking the branch as per their uh, how they go into counseling not as per their importance like for example they want their like anesthesia or ophthalmology or like even if they don't get that they will settle for path so because this require uh, like within 20 10 to 20 20000 rank or i'll say rather 8 to 20000 rank so you can get this branch neat so they have very relaxed life uh, that i am going to study normally and what they do they don't study much also they are just stick to their notes and they read less and then there is a third group i will call you these are anxious people yeah, and i will tell i will tell you that i classify myself in the third group who was anxious and maybe some average or maybe some even the toppers some toppers belong to this group so this is a kind of anxious uh, group of students so what happens in this group so they have the maximum fever fear of fomo so that is if someone who doesn't know fomo fomo is fear of missing out that is fear of missing out so what these people do that they read all the notes they buy all the review books they buy all the plans that are there and they will do all the tnds and everything that is available so they will not keep any stone unturned they will not leave anything behind they will do everything that is required and that is available for pg seat and they will study keep studying they will start doubting about themselves they will go in depression and everything they will face so this is a third group and i think i will classify myself also here and lot of students are here so i'll tell you what happens once net pg results are out so these students as as expected uh they will score like rank 1 to 1000 so they will be there and you will see that they have got their rank and they are very happy about it so the students who are like extremely talented and who are like gold medal who were gold medalist or not necessarily gold medalist in their uh, uh, during their uh, usual life now we have second group second groups are students who were relaxed who were like kind of chilled and now what you will see after a result more i think i what i have noticed that 80% of the student they also get a very good rank and some of them get within 1000 or they end up within 5000 rank what i have noticed is students who were like relaxed and uh, read the limited and the students who were very anxious and uh, who read do uh, who did everything who read all the notes saw all the question bank and uh, saw every test and everything 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 they end up somewhere between 5000 to 6000 like that is a huge range and i am not saying that every one goes there but i think only i'll if you ask me i think only 20% students make up here between 1000 to uh, 5000 80% student from this group they end up here 5000 to 6000 
so what happens and uh, why this happens and this is actually what happened with me as well so when i wrote my first attempt of neat and when i was in the initial part of nicet what i uh, realized what i saw that these three groups i realized that i am missing something mujhe ye laga na ki aise kyu hota hai like i am doing everything i am studying a lot i am reading i am giving my efforts i am sitting in library consistently whole day main kuch bhi time pass nahi kar raha i'm not doing partying i did not watch a single movie i am doing everything and i was going in depression ki mera why i am not succeeding but i think most of you will relate with me hamara koi friend hota hai who did not put so many efforts and i think we think ki hum yaar usse better hi the thode se thode bahut the shayad ki wo bhi accept karta hai kabhi kabhi but still the when the result comes out he scores much better than you and then suddenly you start thinking ki what happened and you start even questioning the authenticity of exam wahan tak baat pahunch jati hai but i'll tell you what happens see the students who are topper they are different let's not uh, let's remove them from the equation because it's very difficult to become like them in such a short uh, period of time and we have to give them the due credit that they were always attentive during their uh, ug second group is the people who are relaxed so see this is code which i realize that pg is a competitive exam here the one who is going to remember the max who is going to reproduce the more information is going to succeed the so students who are relaxed who aim less like who want an scg int uh, aim somewhere 5000 to 50000 rank so they know i just want to read notes i'll just read the read the limited but the, because they are reading less is i'm not saying that they, they do a lot of time pass they just read read the limited material so but they revise it more they read it again and again the same thing and they don't do not go into a lot of things they don't run behind tnds they don't run behind lot of unnecessary stuff but they know that notes maybe i'll do some questions maybe pyq if i were to do or some question bank they do and that's it that is their basic and they they don't doubt themselves because their their funda is very clear i want this rank and i'm going to take this branch and you know surprisingly they you know if you read more you'll have more confusion if you read less if you have less confusion but when you read adequate that that much that you can remember in your exam you will definitely perform better and that that is something i realize so what i did is i knew that i cannot move myself to a topper group so i moved myself to the relaxed group where i thought in my the the year when the semis i mean in the session when i cracked almost all the exams i realized that i just need to concentrate on important topics it's not needed that i should read everything i just need to read my notes read my pyq so what message i want to give from today is that don't take tension don't bring this self doubt see no matter how many other people say but learn from others mistake you have seen your friends getting good rank you have seen people who relax who did party in their ugs but who studied uh, during their uh, internship and their post internship period like before the exam time they also got a very good rank Re- reason is you have to read adequate not uh, don't overdo it don't read much just your notes your uh, mcqs and just revise that period and definitely i, will, I can promise you that you'll get a great rank so move yourself from the anxious group to the better group where you uh, get a chance of uh, getting a good rank so guys i hope uh, this uh, video helps you Now I wish you all the best and if you have any doubt any comment let me know in the comment section all the best